This is an action investigation, emergency local news flash. This special report is brought to you by our award-winning local news reporter, Will Wallace. William. Now on action news. Some have hypothesized that the otherworldly anomalies that have been popping up and getting caught on camera around the world may just be a result of the fact that we are slowly discovering that we are indeed living inside of a digital simulation, a tough and a simulation that glitches from time to time. Well, we have an incredible report. Thousands of callers have reported that a huge, colorful hole has opened up in the gray skies over Metro Detroit. Tonight, even stranger, there are some reports of, well, how can I put it? Hmm. Oh, boy. In short, there are also alleged disturbances in the very fabric of what we all have until this night, known to be normalcy and reality. Now, for more on this unfolding drama, let's throw to our man on the street, Travis Ray, reporting live from a rooftop in downtown Detroit. Travis? Will, ooh, my goodness, this is absolutely mind-blowing. May God have mercy on us all, Will. Can you see this thing? I mean, the damn thing is a massive hole. It's huge, uh, but that's not the worst part, Will. No, no, not by far. See, the worst part is the way the air in front of you just seems to bend reality around you in a very disorienting way. I, I mean, Will, I almost friggin' ate it walking over to this spot with Dan, the cameraman. I'm telling you, Will, the damn roads seem to swallow my feet, and the world around me seemed, um, surreal. Something about the air itself seemed, uh, almost digitally animated. Uh... Whoa! Look at what they've done to Detroit now. Just when you thought it couldn't possibly be any worse. This is all bad! Another one, um, another, uh, portal thing, uh, has just appeared over the river. Ah! Not too far from Hart Plaza. Um, Travis? Travis, we're going to throw it now to Tarquisha Mohammed McGee, who is standing by right now near Hart Plaza. Tarquisha? Residents and downtown commuters say the enormous, mysterious stargate, as they call it, suddenly opened up over the transcending structure in Hart Plaza sometime around midnight. The Detroit police blocked off the downtown exit on the John C. Lodge freeway. Due to reports of mass hallucinations and disillusionment reportedly experienced by a variety of citizens, whether while walking or driving, all driving on Jefferson is temporarily prohibited until further notice in order to keep both drivers and pedestrians safe while authorities work to figure out the next step. The DPD also is asking Detroiters to avoid the downtown area, and they ask for residents to stay indoors, also, until further notice. This is Tarquisha Muhammad McGee, Local News Special Report. And that last jam was by D-Point and the Midnight Man. Shout out to Jerry Flynn and them boys down at Detroit's own Deaf Sound Studio. What up though, fellas? But hold up. Say what? What the? Wait, this Justin, y'all. Hmm. Okay, okay. There's some crazy stuff happening downtown. So if you happen to be headed that way, be advised. The DPD have shut down the Lodge Freeway headed downtown. And, um, well... Now, I'm not sure, but we are getting some weird reports from callers claiming that, now get this. We're actually flooded right now with calls from concerned citizens talking about it's some end of the world mess going on. What in the hell?
All praise is due to the living and true. Stop. 